Today I'm going to show you how to test silver using just an ice cube. This quick test can be really helpful if you've got a piece of jewelry you're unsure about and don't have the proper tools to conduct a more thorough examination. Remember, for precise results, it's always best to consult a professional who has the right equipment to determine what your jewelry is made out of. Now the concept behind this test is based on silver's thermal conductivity, which is its ability to transfer heat. Silver has one of the highest thermal transfer rates at 429 watts per kelvin per meter, compared to other common materials like brass sitting at 111, iron sitting at 79.6, and stainless steel sitting at just 15. Because of this, silver should melt through an ice cube faster than the other metals. Now the materials you need for this test are pretty simple. All you need is some ice and a piece of jewelry that you want to test. So in order to conduct the test, I'll be placing two ice cubes in a container side by side and then setting a silver ring on top of one and an iron ring on top of the other one. Now the silver ring is sterling silver or 92.5% and the iron ring is roughly 70% iron. Now we'll let the, them sit on top of the ice for 15 minutes and see how the ice reacts to each metal. Let's get started and let's see what happens.
Okay. Now the 15 minutes is up. Let's take a look at our results here. So I can see here, probably better than you guys can, that the silver ring has melted much more through the ice. It looks like it's like a part of the ice. The iron one's slowly getting there. If we left it more time, I mean, they would have both gotten through it. But I'm just going to take them off so we can take a look. As you can see, it's just sitting on it. And the silver one, it also comes off easily, but it's much deeper in there. Okay, guys, so that's going to be the test for today. If you enjoyed the video or learned something or just curious about the reaction here, please leave it a like and I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you.